Last warning. Shut the engine off. Ugh, she just tased me. Dispatch, oh, you bet. Ugh, get up. Dispatch, show me in pursuit. Hey there, guys. Welcome back. We're going to be patrolling out here in Sandy Shores. And we're going to get straight into the action. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, we just got a call from dispatch that uh, two neighbors are fighting. So we're going to head on back over this way. I think the uh, call out is uh, based on two neighbors fighting, if I'm not mistaken. Like a more of a domestic dispute. So we're going to go handle this real fast. And uh, see what we can kind of get into with this. And I do believe it's going to be in this uh, like a trailer home over here to the right. Yeah, it appears to be about right there. I see a guy with his dog. I have not done this call, so I'm not sure what to expect. This is from definitive call outs, by the way. Dispatch, show me 23. We're going to be on scene. 1018. We're in the drive. Roger that. Sam, 81. Approach with caution. Hey, it doesn't appear that we really need to have backup on this. It's probably just two people fighting, you know. Let's see. I got one guy to the right with his dog. And it uh, looks like Jim Bob over the left with his overalls. Uh, let's see here. I'll tell you what. Let's talk to the uh, guy with the dog first. He looks a little bit more interesting. All right, let's see what he has to say here. Hey, officer. I'm glad you came so quickly. Hey, sir. Hey, tell me what's going on. That person over there keeps throwing trash at my property in my car. All right, so how long has this been going on? It started recently, like maybe three months ago or something like that. All right, give me a minute to talk to him, all right? So let's see what else I can do for you. Okay, that's a cool little dog. It's like a little husky. I had a husky once when I was young. Hey there, sir. Hey there, officer. Uh, can you tell me that dickhead over there? Uh, leave my family alone. All right, calm down. Calm down. What's going on? This motherfucker keeps letting his dog shit on my lawn, so I'll just throw it back on his. I see. I need to check a few things out. I'll be right back, okay? Please try to stay calm in the meantime, okay? My fucking ride. He's coming back doing? here. Hey, Zeus. What's going on with this dog? Oh, shit. Hey. Oh, man, I don't want to have to shoot the dog. Hey. Dog. Hey. Oh, my gosh. Shots fired. Shots fired. Oh, shit. Damn. Oh my god, man. Holy hell. Dispatch, be advised. We got two suspects down. We got multiple gunshots out here. Got two suspects down. Stage RA just down the street for us. Holy hell, he shot me right in the arm. Damn, he shot the dog too. I was not expecting that. I'm not touching this asshole. That gloves. Dispatch requesting RA. We're going to be 1018 Panorama Drive. We got two suspects down. And we're probably going to get some animal control out here in just a moment. Ambulance. Assistance required. And okay, we have ambulance coming, but uh, let me go ahead and search this guy. So we'll make sure he doesn't have anything else on him. Okay, let's see what else he has on him. Wow. So he had some illegal prescription pills. Uh, he got tagged, if I'm not mistaken, that looks like the, um, close to the eyeball. Uh, yeah. Wow. You want to see a replay on that? Oh, sick. Okay. Sick, I'm telling you. Okay. Sick in the Benzo Effect channel. Oh, y'all can clear out. I can go ahead and clear out. Oh, man, poor dog. This guy got lit up. Okay, rescue ambulances on scene. They're tended to him, and I guess I'll call for animal control. Dispatch requesting animal control. 1018. Uh, we got a uh, doggy down. That sucks, man. I'm more sad that the animal died than I on these scumbags. Okay, they're uh, doing CPR on his uh, growing, but hey, you know, I don't judge. What? How did he live? How did he live? Oh, do you want to see a replay on that guy? Oh my gosh. Y'all sick. Sick, I'm telling you. Why do you watch me? Uh, we do have animal control en route. But, uh, this poor little dog, man. Yeah, he got shot, man. 
Uh, they already took the other guy away. Yeah. All right. Load him up. So there's the animal control unit back over there. Uh, SWAT seems to be standing around for some reason, but that's okay. Okay, so not much I can really do with that. Uh, big neighbor, neighbor dispute. That was crazy. Crazy argument. I was not expecting that. All right, let me get my gloves off. And we're going to go ahead and continue with our patrol. Having too much fun here. And let's move on, man, because that was a crazy way to start the episode. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, we're going to continue with our patrol here. And we're going to monitor that stop sign. That guy just ran a... He ran a stop sign, like completely ran the stop sign. <laughs> Didn't even try to stop. Okay, he'll be our first traffic stop of the day. And plus, I want to show off my new dash cam. All right, we'll see uh, what this guy's deal is right here. Looks like he's pulling over fairly well. Sam D1. This is dispatch. Dispatch, show me a 1011. We're going to be East Alhambra Drive, 1029. Going to be for a two door Picador, white and color, occupied two dumps. Stand by for the 28. Go ahead. Requesting 28. Two door Picador, occupied two times, four nine, Queen Ocean Union, seven two nine. Here's my new dash cam. Check it out. Target vehicle license plate, four niners, Queen Ocean Union, seven two niners. Target is ten four. All right, so let's go have a word with them. And here's the cool part is that I can over actually come up this way and walk over to him and you can actually see this in third person action dash cam footage pretty cool right hey sir hey it's gonna be a sergeant benzo it's gonna be a blank kind of sheriff you went right through the stop sign man give your uh, license registration insurance are y'all sweaty i'm sorry i said sir i meant ma'am i can't tell who's driving because i'm in third person give me a break okay christabel moore uh, registered on is Marcus uh, Fortuna. Okay, Fortuna Major or okay, sorry. All right, any reason why you, you, you stop paying attention? Is that what it is? All right, why are you all sweaty? Hey, passenger, you have your ID as well. Pass that over to me. Thank you, sir. Oh, uh, he's the registered owner. I wonder if, what's going on with these guys. All right, stand by, ma'am. Uh, anything illegal in the vehicle? Okay, driver. Uh, would you mind shutting down the vehicle just for a sec? Okay, thank you. All right, I'll be right back with you, all right? But I really like this dash cam. This is from the Axon body signal. Uh, he did an upgrade on this. It's pretty cool. So here's Christabel Moore. Uh, she seems to be pretty valid. Uh, no issues. Well, uh, let's see here. And this is Marcus Fortune. The same thing. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and create a citation for her. This failure to stop at a stop sign. Not a big deal. We're going to submit the citations. Now we're going to print it out for her. All right. Looking good. And uh, we'll approach the vehicle back over here. Okay, Miss Moore. That's what we're going to do, okay? We're going to be getting a uh, citation. Yeah, it's going to be for just running the stop sign. Yeah, it's going to be about a $215 ticket, but but your record's pretty clean, so yeah, the uh, judge may show a little leniency on that. There you go. Uh, by signing the bottom of this ticket, it's not a mini guilt. It's going to say you're an appearing to court law, or you can handle it by phone. There's an 800 number on the back, 555-1234, Monday through Friday. And then if you decide to go to court over this, I just realized that I show up to court about eight hours early. And I just sleep in the lobby, typically. Uh, yeah, usually my boxers or something like that. Not that you need to know that, but... Okay, very good. All right, uh, we'll go ahead and uh, wait for myself to get back in the vehicle. Then you can go ahead and take off, right? Dispatch to Sam, AD1, report. Dispatch, show me uh, code 4. Where are we going back tonight? Uh, when Charlie given. All right, let's go. Copy that. Sam, AD1, proceed to patrol area. Okay, she's going to take off. All right, so that uh, dash cam is kind of cool, right? 
it takes a little bit of getting used to walking, you know, out, um, you know, into dash cam range, to be honest. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we're going to go ahead and continue with our patrol. Let me know if you want to see more of that kind of footage. Uh, yeah, I think it's pretty cool, personally. And uh, we're going to get back out on patrol and see what else we can get into. Citizens report a possible 480 on... Are they got a dead body? Oh, that's right here. Like right next to me. What? Dispatch, show me responding. I'm like right here in the area. 10 4, copy that. Sam, 81. Oh, that's like right across the street from us. What? Okay, let's go over here and see what's going on. There's a lot of hikers out here. Maybe they found a dead body. There's like nobody around. What's up with this? Oh, man. Looks like he may have gotten shot. Is what I'm feeling. Okay, let's be extra careful here. Uh, yeah, he got shot for sure. Either that or hit by a train. What do you What do you think? It looks like like a bullet wound, right? Let's see if we can check him out. Dispatch, show me twenty three one zero three six. We got a possible uh, DOA here on scene. Standby. Copy that, Sam. Indeed, one. Proceed with caution. Yeah, it's hard to tell. I think he's been shot though. Uh, you can see, like, bullet wound to the back and also to the leg. Well, actually, both legs and looks like to the head, too. You can see right there. All right. Well, here, let's do this. Dispatch, requesting CSI. My location, 1036 East Joshua Road. We got DOA. It's going to be a WMA. Multiple gunshot wounds and uh, brain matter on the ground out here. Assistance required on... East Joshua Rose. Okay, let me go ahead and search him a little bit and see if what he has on his person. See if we can maybe look him up. He had some illegal prescription pills and some baggie of white powder. Look, sounds like maybe a drug deal gone bad. Is what it sounds like to me. All right, uh, let's set up a crime scene since it seems to be like a CSI type of investigation. Take off my gloves. We don't really need those anymore. Oh, we got CSI rolling in. Uh, let's see what they look like here. Okay, I didn't really get a chance to set up a crime scene too much. I should have done that probably before I called them, but we got some barricades there. And then uh, they're going to put him in the back of my, my unit over here. But uh, this, uh, I like this uh, CSI unit. Yeah, he's back there. Oh, let me see if I can look him up real fast. Oh man, I hate that function where you can't look them up anymore uh, because they're in their body bag, right? That's kind of silly, right? Oh, don't go through my barricades, man. You know how much money that costs the county? Oh, great, thanks. <laughs> okay, we deleted them out. I really wanted to look the guy up, you know, on the police computer, but that's all right. But uh, we'll continue with our patrol here. Dispatch, show me code four. Bring you back tonight. Uh, CSI has already finished up their business here. Okay, we just got dispatched to a call. It says multiple complaints of a sports car driving recklessly at high rates of speed. I mean, near Harmony. Okay. Uh, they Actually, they want us to go code three to this location. I guess it's pretty reckless, right? Uh, this siren is called a Whelan Syncom Sapphire Hauer. Because uh, I know I'm going to get that question asked. It's a very popular siren. Uh, that link to that siren is in my website. Uh, the website link is down below. Okay, so they got a uh, Cyclone. Uh, that's a really nice sports car. Okay, they're asking us to reduce code. And uh, to search for the Cyclone. Whoa, hello. Oh, that's one of my undercover units. It's a Dodge Ram. <laughs> what is he doing? Maybe he's looking for the vehicle, too. That's what it is. He's looking for the vehicle. Maybe we'll stage about right here is what I'm feeling now. Oh, there he is right there. Dispatch, be advised. We got eyes on that vehicle. It's going to be a dark-colored cyclone. Stand by. He's taking off on me. Damn, he's, hot. he's hauling some ass. Dispatch, hold the air. Uh, he's taking off on me. High rates of speed, stand by. Initiating traffic, stop.
Dispatch, be advised. He's pulling over here. Uh, 919. Appears to be a WFA. He's taking off again. Son of a bitch, man. He's taking off. Let's get a dash cam view. Okay, now he came to a stop. Dispatch, be advised. Uh, looks like this. Uh, it's going to be a white female. She came to a stop. Can you copy a plate for me, please? 67 David Edward Ida 148. 67 David Edward Ida 148. This is reckless driving. Target vehicle license plate. 67 David Edward Ida 148. Target is 104. She's clear. Dispatch requesting code 2 back up here. She's uh, pulled over now. Uh, we're going to be 1008 Clafia Road and uh, West Joshua intersection. Backup required on Clafia Road. Now, normally I'd probably get him out by gunpoint, but uh, I'm not sure what the hell she's doing. She did pull over for me. So that, that's a good thing. Dispatch, she can lift the air for now. She's uh, pulled over. Go ahead and lift that air. We're gonna free up the emergency traffic. She seems to be cooperating now. But we're gonna go ahead and get out here. Hey there, Ranger. Okay, let's go ahead and have a chat. Okay, ma'am. Hey, do you have your uh, license registration insurance on you? Hannah Green. Okay, Hannah, I'm sure you know why I'm pulling you over, right? I mean, uh, you were driving extremely reckless. Okay, no else. Uh, Hannah, do me a favor. Shut off the vehicle. Just shut it off completely. Shut it off. She's refusing to uh, shut the vehicle down. Okay, Miss Green, I'm going to tell you one more time, okay? Shut the vehicle off. Shut it off. Dispatch, be advised. She's being non-cooperative here. Uh, we're going to be 1008. Stand by. Requesting code 2 back up here again. Uh, we're going to be 1008. We need an additional unit here. Okay, we got an additional unit coming. Okay, Miss Green, I'm not sure why you're being so difficult, okay? You're driving extremely reckless. And I'm going to give you one more opportunity uh, to get out of that vehicle, okay? Last warning. Shut the engine off. She just tased me. Oh, you bitch. Ugh, get up. Dispatch, show me in pursuit. God, bitch. Dispatch, be advised. She tased me from the uh, window. Can't believe she tased me, man. Oh, that bitch. That, this, uh, look at this park ranger. He's on point, guys. Dispatch, we have 115. Uh, thanks to the park ranger out here. And this guy is on point. Attention, Where's his vehicle at? <laughs> this guy is on point. Okay, you know what? That's going to be another charge, okay? Here, I'm going to get her to face my dash cam right there. All right, anything's going to poke me? State me harm anyway? Okay, I can pat her down now in front of the dash cam. Seems a little bit more legit, right? A few tablets and a plastic container. Okay, interesting. I'm going to show you something else really cool with this dash cam. Check this out, guys. Watch this. Ready for this? This is something really cool. I've never seen it before. Now watch this. Look, she's in the back seat. <laughs> it's so cool, right? So you know how some of these uh, police units have the uh, dash cam uh, they're facing their rear side so they can see what's happening in the back seat in case they're committing more crimes, like trying to get out of cuffs or saying something they shouldn't have, things like that. But there she is right there. Okay, let's do some charges for Miss Green. See what else we can kind of come up with here. Because uh, that was ridiculous. She tased me from her car. What the hell? Okay, let's take a look at the uh, those tablets, right? Because there, there could be something in that, that tablet or something like that. And let's see if uh, this is going to be... Nope. Okay, maybe PCP. It's got to be the last one, right? 
Yeah, PCP. That's what it is right there. Dispatch, show me 10-7 for about three mics. Now we're going to do some charges here. Acknowledged. Here, let's check in on her and see how she's doing back there. Hey there, Miss Green. You doing all right? Okay. Let me turn the AC on. It's getting hot. I'm being very nice because you taste me. But you're still going to get charged for that as well. But, you know, we are human, so we're not complete animals here. All right, stand by. Okay, yeah, uh, we did some, uh, we got the AC going for her. Uh, let's do some charges for her. It's going to be Hannah Green. Uh, one thing we're going to charge her with right here is vehicular assault because uh, my uh, my memory's a little bit fuzzy, but I think she went underneath one of our vehicles, right? It's either that or a civilian car. Uh, either way, she was ramming uh, cars as well. So we're going to say vehicular assault. So that's one. We're going to say aggravating fleeing, attempting to elude LEO. So that's going to be aggravating on that. Uh, we're going to say leaving the scene of an accident with bodily injury. <laughs> okay, I'm not sure if this is going to be right or not, uh, but there is one right here uh, for assault on a law enforcement officer. I was so tempted to do this one here, assault with a deadly weapon. But I think this one here, assault on a law enforcement officer, uh, would, may carry just the same weight as the deadly weapon, and it's more likely to uh, stick because I had it on dash cam. Do you want to see a replay of that? Last warning. Shut the engine off. She just tased me. Oh, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> it's kind of cool at the same time, but embarrassing. Oh, we're going to hit her a couple other charges here. Reckless driving and then uh, reckless speed, 30 plus. Mm -hmm. I think we'll hit her with that. Uh, and then also she had PCP. So, man, I cannot wait to see her charges. Whoa, that's a lot of charges. Look at this. So many, in fact, you have to go over to the next button. <laughs> Look, there's the next one. I was so tempted to charge her with this right here, being a Karen. You know what I'm saying? She even looks like one. Uh, this one here, I've got it set to um, pretty much life in prison or the death penalty. <laughs> but uh, we'll try to stay realistic for this patrol anyway. A little bit anyway. You know what I mean? I'm sure you feel me. So we got the dash cam view uh, right here. And then uh, we can check in on her. Watch this. See if she's uh, causing any mischief. Dispatch requesting a 51. Uh, we're going to be located at 1007 near Stab City. 67 David Edward Ida 148 involved in vehicle pursuit. Flatbed. Assistance required in Zancudo River. Uh, All right, let's get back in our vehicle and we'll call for dispatch here too. Dispatch requesting PT. Uh, we got a prisoner transport here 1007 near uh, Stab City. Flop your road. Assistance required. I want to see what it looks like when she gets picked River. up. This is going to be so cool. Okay, let's, uh, I'll do a little bit of editing until they roll up. I want to see what happens. Oh, there she goes. That is so cool. Uh, you can adjust the angle, the pitch of the uh, cam. You can lower it. You can raise it. You can bring it forward. You can change the, uh, the field of view. It is so cool what this mod can do. Uh, you have no idea. Uh, this thing is probably one of the best dash cam mods I've ever used. And I'm sure he's going to tweak it even better, so... Yeah, let's go ahead and uh, head on out of here. I'm not sure why that... Uh, I think he wants an award or something, guys. Just kidding. No, I'm not going to do that. Okay, let's do the uh, court cases real fast because I'm really anxious to see what happens to her. I know this is kind of unrealistic uh, because she was just picked up, but, you know, just kind of roll with it a little bit. Uh, this is going to be... Uh, let's see. Let's back it up a little bit. Uh, Christabel Moore. That's uh, just uh, running a stop sign. I'm going to say uh, since it was a $257 ticket... I'm going to say $195. Ooh, look how close I was. Guys, up by $1. Come on. Hannah Green. You can see all the charges there. It looks like they got them all on one page, which is good. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to say, we'll say 16 years in prison and a $5,000 fine. Oh, gosh. I was so close. Look at this. 17 years in prison and pretty close to the, to the fine, too. Look at this. And uh, leaving the scene of an accident, bodily injury, <laughs> granted probation. And then you can see all the years that she got. Let's see, what was it for assault on a law enforcement officer? Just one year, really? I mean, I think my body's worth more than that. She got two years right here for reckless driving and license suspended. That is weird. Why is that higher than, than me? <laughs> it's so weird. Okay, so that'll go ahead and wrap it up. Uh, thank you to the legendary patrons for all the side support. If you guys have not thought about Patreon, you should really give it a look. I set it as low as possible. It's like a dollar, okay? Low as possible. I've got a lot of videos in there right now to help with texture loss, 
gameplay crashes, especially with scriptv.net, some few tips and tricks uh, with vehicle sounds and, uh, you know, to get your engine sounding right, some uh, all kinds of cool stuff. And we have a fast draw script on there. There's a lot of cool stuff on there, guys. You got to check it out. That is available only on Patreon, Patreon exclusive videos. So thank you guys for watching and we'll catch you in the next episode. Take care and stay safe. Thank you for watching Benzo's YouTube channel. Be sure to drop a like, comment and subscribe if you're new. Benzo uploads often, so stay tuned for the next episode.